welcome back to my channel and today is very special because I have something to share with you all and it is the finished copy of Wicked Fox. So I actually went to Penguin to do some fun things with Penguin Teen and when I got there uh, Felicity and Shannon from the Penguin Teen team came downstairs and they had something a little bit weird with them. I didn't understand like why they had this tote and they were carrying it kind of weirdly and then they told me it was a surprise for me and I kind of immediately guessed what it was but I also was just like so thrilled for like the chance to see a finished copy of my book for the first time and they're really nice because they helped me film my first impressions of the finished copy so I will put that right here. the audio it wasn't the best we were in the lobby of the penguin random house offices which are very big and lofty and echoey and it was very spur of the moment we were not planning to do this or I wasn't planning for this to happen so when they came down showing it I was like oh let's film it because I have I happen to have my camera and this will be really fun to share with people like my first impressions but I didn't want it to like force us to go to like another place and find a place for filming because that like didn't seem genuine like they came down to the lobby to show me these beautiful books and I just wanted to film it right then and there just to show you the exact moment when I realized that my finished books were ready. It was such an amazing experience to be able to see my finished copy and now I'm holding it in my hands and there are just some things that I kind of wanted to show you because it doesn't exist on the ARC which is the advanced reader copies that are out right now so I just wanted to share some of the fun things that I absolutely adore about the finished copy and so the first thing is going to actually be this which is a blurb from the amazing Renee Adier and you guys I don't I don't know if it's apparent or not, but I adore Renee. I adore her writing. I adore her talent and her like glamorous Instagram. And the fact that she blurbed my book was when I, when my editor told me I got a blurb from Renee, I literally fell out of my chair. That is not a lie or an exaggeration. Friends were there. They will verify that I fell out of my chair. So yes, I was so excited about that. And then another thing that I really love is that on the spine, first of all, I love this typography. I love it. I've always loved it. But on the spine, they put, oop, can you see it? Oopsies. Yay. Isn't she so pretty? I love her so much. And she gets to be on the spine. So even when she's sitting on the bookshelf, she's looking at you and she's watching you. So you better not mess up. <laughs> and then of course on the back I have some another amazing authors saying nice things about my book like honestly I will ne never get over the fact that people have read my book let alone like my book let alone authors that I admire and look up to are blurbing my book so thank you so much to Renee Adia again Ellen O who is the fabulous author of the uh, prophecy as well as spirit hunters um, and just the and just an amazing human being she is a co-founder of we need Diver books I love her so much and then Tracy Chi who's a New York Times best-selling author of the reader so yes I adore these ladies and Asian women power for the win okay the next thing is a nice note from my editor <laughs> I love this color this auburn color 
Auburn? Is that the name? Magenta? Anyway, I love it. <laughs> I love it even though I can't say what it is in the foil and oh, I love it so much. It makes me so happy. And then of course, I, I'm here, it's me. Okay, hold on, let me just, wait. Twinsies. <laughs> I'm gonna cut that out of the video. I look ridiculous. Anyway. <sighs> yes. Finished copy of The Wicked Fox. It's going to be out in like a month, you guys. And I... I don't know what to do with myself. Like, I'm dying a little bit inside of excitement and fear and joy and dread and all of the things that come with making something purely from your imagination and your mind and loving it and loving it and loving it for years and then trying to share it with the world. Yeah, so that's pretty much, in a nutshell, all the things that are going through my head. And I'm sure more things will join it in the next month, but I hope you guys enjoy this book and I hope that you find it as gorgeous as I do. Also, shout out to the artist and illustrator of this cover, Miranda Meeks. I'm gonna put her website right here and I'm gonna, I'm gonna put her website down below because illustrators deserve so much credit for how gorgeous they make our books and they deserve all the shout outs. They do really great jobs with all the art direction that they're getting from multiple people, including editors, art directors, designers from in-house, the authors, our agents, everyone has opinions. And I just absolutely adore the collaborative effort that went into this cover and how it came out. So yes, I'm so happy. And I hope you guys enjoy Wicked Fox when it's out June 25th. So if you liked this video, pre-order Wicked Fox, or just give me a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel, and I'll see everybody next time. Bye! <laughs>